ಶ್ರೀಮಾನ್ವೆಂಕಟನಾಥಾರ್ಯ ಕವಿತಾರ್ಕಿಕೇಸರೀ ವೇದಾಂತಾಚಾರ್ಯವರ್ಯೋ ಮೇ ಸನ್ನಿಧತ್ತ ಸದಾ ಹೃದಿ ರಾಮಾನುಜದಯ ಪಾತ್ರ ಜ್ಞಾನವೈರಾಗ್ಯಭೂಷಣ ಶ್ರೀಮದ್ವೆಂಕಟನಾಥಾರ್ಯ ವಂದೇ ವೇದಾಂತದೇಶಿ ಶೀರುನೃತೂಪುಲ್ ತಿರುವೆಂಗಡಮುಡಯಾನ್ ಪಾರುನ್ರಚೊನ್ನ ಪಳಮೊಳ್ಳು ಊರುನೃತಾನೇ ಅಮಯಾದೋ ತಾರಣಿಯಲ್ ವಾಳ್ವಾರ್ಕ್ ವಾನೇರ ಭೂಮಳವಂ ವಾಳ್ವ ತಡತ್ವ ವಿಭುತ್ವಂಗಳೇ ಉಡೈತಾಯ್ ಬಾಲ ವೃದ್ಧಾದಿ ವ್ಯವಸ್ಥೆಗಳಿಗೆ ವಿಶೇಷ ಕಾರಣಮಾನ ದ್ರವ್ಯ ಇದು ಎಪ್ಪೋದು ಅವೋ ವಸ್ತುಗಳುಡೆಯ ಭೂತ ಭವಿಷ್ಯ ವರ್ತಮಾನ ವ್ಯಪದೇಶಗಳು ತನ್ ಅವಚ್ಛೇದಗಳೇ ನಿಯಾಮಕಮಾಗಿರುತ್ತೆ ಇದಕ್ಕೆ ಸತ್ವಾದಿ ಗುಣತ್ರಯ ಮುಖ ಸತ್ವಾದಿ ಗುಣವು ಇಂದ್ರಿಕೆ ಉಪಾಧಿ ವಿಶೇಷಗಳೇ ಶೀತಕಾಲ ಉಷ್ಣಕಾಲ ಎನ್ನುವ ಪೋಲೆ ಸಾತ್ವಿಕ ರಜಸ ತಾಮಸಾದಿ ಕಾಲ ವಿಭಾಗ ಉಂಟಾಗಿರದು ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ದಿವಸ ಮೊದಲ ಮನುಷ್ಯ ದಿವಸ ಪರ್ಯಂತ ಎಂದು ಇದು ಕಂಡುಕೊಳ್ಳುವುದು ಶುದ್ಧ ಶುದ್ಧ ಸತ್ವತ್ತಿ ಇಪ್ಪಡಿಪ್ಪಟ್ಟ ಕಾಲ ವಿಭಾಗವಿಂದ್ರಿಕೆ ಪೂರ್ವ ಅಪರಾಧಿ ಪೂರ್ವ ಅಪರಾಧಿ ವಿಭಾಗ ಮಾತ್ರವೇ ಮೇ ಆಗಿರುತ್ತೆ Now, uh, let us uh, have the paragraph. Uh, Keshwada Swami should go to the next page also. Uh, what uh, Ranga Prasad Swami read it now. So, uh, we, are, we are going to read afterwards the Shuddha Sattva Mahavad. Uh, let us take the uh, 31, page 31. Uh, we have been uh, discussing yesterday. about uh, three uh, aspects combined with uh, sattva rajas tamas these, these are the three qualities which we have and uh, we have been seeing what we call panchi karana along with the karmendriyas namely uh, what we call organs for motor organs then you have sense organs wisdom organs five pancha jnanendriyani then we have tanmatras and panchabhuta so pancha tanmatras five tanmatras and five uh, gras elements that what we have been seeing and we have been seeing uh, the, the same uh, 31 page footnote under footnote we have been say, uh, seeing how panchi karana is done so half of one element namely of the five ಪೃಥ್ವಿ ತೇಜಿ ತೇಜೋ ಅಪ್ಪು ವಾಯು ಆಕಾಶ ಒನ್ ಹಾಫ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಟೇಕನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದಿ ಅದರ್ ಒನ್ ಬೈ ಏಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಎಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಟೇಕನ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಅದರ್ ಫೋರ್ ಇಂಡಿಯನ್ ದಿ ಕಂಬೈನ್ ಟುಗೆದರ್ ಫೈನಲಿ ದ ರಿಸಲ್ಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಷನ್ ದ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಷನ್ ಇಮ್ ಬಿಕಮ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ ಪ್ರಕೃತಿ ವಿ ಸೇ ಪ್ರಾಕೃತ ಲೋಕ then we come to vikriti changes in the uh, creation and all these are of course dependent upon the place and the time so the time is uh, the essence of the matter here the time is of the essence the so kalam avad what is kalam what is time actually the word in sanskrit is kalaha uh ಭರದ್ವಾ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಸೇಯಿಂಗ್ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ಇನ್ ದಟ್ ವೇ ಕಾಲ ಚೇಂಜಸ್ ಇನ್ ನಪುಂಸಕಲಿಂಗನ್ ನ್ಯೂಟ್ರ ಜೆಂಡರ್ ಜಡತ್ವ ವಿಭುತ್ವಂಗಳೇ ಉಡೈಸ್ತಾನ್ ಜಡತ್ವ ಯು ನೋ ದಿ ಇನ್ನರ್ ಸ್ಕಿಲ್ ಲೈಫ್ಲೆಸ್ ಥಾಟ್ಲೆಸ್ ದಟ್ ಕಾಲ್ ದ ಜಡತ್ವ and vibhutva is all pervading nature these are two what we call uh, abstract concepts so here the time uh, jadatva vibhutva 
M and N. Now we have uh, uh, three uh, stages for God and four stages for us. So in our life, so we go through the childhood. So you can say Bala. Bala is childhood. Then you have the old age. Jara, we say in Sanskrit. We, we call it in uh, Sanskrit, which is a familiar term for all of us, Vridha, an old person. So, Bala Vridha, in between we have two for us. We are all called the Chaturdashaha. We have got four stages, whereas we have three stages for uh, God. They are called the Three Dashaha. So, uh, I would always say it in English, uh, easy, easier to say. So, childhood, Youthhood, adulthood. Maybe youthhood and adulthood are some, sometimes synonymous, and uh, there is no uh, separate word for uh, in Sanskrit to tell us these four stages of life. So what I would say is uh, childhood. If you want to say boyhood, okay. Instead of youthhood, you can say boyhood. We say teenage. We say teenage. So up to nineteen. Starting with 13, 13 to 19, we say teenage. And what do you say in English also? Delinquency. Delinquency. Juvenile delinquency is the meaning of the uh, teenage. Rather, uh, Bala, Bala. Bala is the juvenile delinquency. And uh, they have a different way of expression, different uh, attitude, different feelings in the young age. Then slowly we become mature after we become adult. And uh, you have this uh, uh, sentence in Bhagavad Gita. Uh, so they, they say, uh, Shaishavam Yavvanam Jara Tata Dehantara Praptihi Dhiras Tatra So you have this Bhagavad Gita statement. So Bala Vridhadi, so Adi etc. Vyavasthai Halukri. Vyavastha means status, condition. In Tamil, it is meant wrongly. Avastha means suffering. In Tamil, avastai is Avastai, avastai padugurara means he is suffering. But it is not so. Avastha is a particular status. In any condition. Good condition also can be called avastha. So here it is good condition added with a upasarka prefix called me. So it becomes vyavastha. So this is what we call another condition or status in life. So we are going through the boyhood as well as old age. Uh, we say decrepit, decrepit. Debility sets in. Debility sets in as the age advanced. Weakness. So Bala Vrdadi, so Vishesha Karanamana Dravyam. So Kalam becomes Dravyam, a, a piece of matter. Kalam becomes Dravyam. Dravyam doesn't mean as we say in uh, other uh, contexts, namely the, the changeable uh, object of tangibility. So suppose you have tangible object, you can touch it. And that is called Dravyam in Tamil or in other contexts. Dravyam also meaning, uh, as you know, Dravam is liquid, as we say in Tamil also. Dravam means liquid. Rather, it's a fluid. It's uh, both solid and uh, liquid combined together. So we call it fluid. And that will always uh, move away, flow, flow from the higher level to the lower level. That is called the dravyam. But please uh, avoid these meanings here. So this is uh, kalam is dravyam. Kalaha is dravyam. Kalaha is one of the objects. But uh, they are not tangible. Kalam, you can just. Uh, See the see it passing off, but you cannot you can you can realize it as passing off, but you cannot see it. So every day, every second, every moment is going passed off. So we don't know we don't know how we pass. So this is a, this is how so suddenly one becomes old. At the age of sixty, he looks eighty. In that way, so you have. So uh, this is uh, this is a special uh, what we call ma dravyam matter which influences our 
uh, age rather the what we call uh, the growth of uh, one's human life so it is epodum so this is for forever avva vastukaludeya bhoota bhavishyat vartamana vyapadeshangalukkum so now it is added to the past tense the future tense and present tense so this is what we call the sorry present time not tense sorry the grants grammar so bhoota is past time old time which has gone away bhavishyat future time vartamana present time why it is uh, in this order uh, we say we have to look at the present time rather than remembering the past time and remembering some bad experiences in the past time and then uh, expecting something negative in the future time also we expect something negative in the future time also that also has to be avoided so what to, what should we think we must think of good things done in the past good good opportunities that we got and in future also we have to be very positive rather optimistic about the future and of course we live the present we live the present but we don't know uh, the bhavishya but uh, we know uh, bhuta but sometimes we forget so vyapadeshangalukku so you have the uh, in english uh, sorry put note for or we will say it see it afterward tan avachchedangalale avachcheda is division avachchedangalale ched to cut avachcheda is division so chedangal avachchedangalale niyamakama irukkum the time controls us that's a problem the time controls the time according to our age bala vridha etc and bhuta bhavishyat vartamana etc and uh, kalam becomes controller kalam has a switch for control niyamakama irukku that means our early boyhood childhood youthhood adulthood old age um, plus uh, the past future and present are depending upon or call they are called niyamya niyamya so niyamya they are to be controlled so and therefore we have uh, kala is the, the important one important one and idarku satvadi gunatrayamum indriki the kala the time will work even without these three namely sattva rajas and tamas so even without this these these three the qualities the good quality the belligerent um, well quality and the bad quality rather the ignorance of um, darkness of ignorance uh, proud attitude and uh, all other good qualities all good qualities they they are not uh, connected uh, here with the kala uh, but upadi visheshangalale now we have got some condition upadi meaning condition avastha also meaning condition avastha is there is status but here in upadi is condition we say in english provided provided so the word upadi so visheshangalale something special and some extraordinary condition Uh, now the footnotes are uh, visible to all of all of us uh, we will take up this uh, before going to the next word sita kala so you find here uh, yam yam and n so in the bottom so you will find yam is arivartamai that is what we call jadatvam i told you jadatvam is inat i n e r t then you have still s t i l l then you have feelingless emotionless uh, thoughtless and so uh, we uh, we say jadatvam jadatvam is called uh, arivartame we have no thinking capacity then engum padandirital that what you call vibhutva i told you lord is our lord shivanarayana is we are vibhu and we are all atomic in nature we are anu then you have vo irandakalam past time the idrgalam bhavishyat 
very future time q nihal galam vartamana and then you have r that is varangadal uh, it offers so it all the column time offers then you have yes a uh, narige narige is the time so i hear nar mudaliya utpirivugal i told you so starting from the uh, minutest time you can divide a second by 16 and it is called kala and uh, so you can go go further increase it in the what is called ascending order kala kshanam kshanam is one second and then kshanam is called vinadi and otherwise the vinadi becomes minute we don't say nimesha in tamil only nimisham is minute in sanskrit nimesha is the eye bro moving from the top to the uh, cover the eye that's all eye bro so that is the nimesha so that means we wink we wink for one second two times and uh, so we have the what is called uh, there is another time called kashtha then we have lot of words to tell you then uh, 60 seconds according to english calculation but uh, but according to our ancient calculation is two and half nadikas become that's what s says nadigi two and half nadikas become one hour in english 60 minutes and 24 hours is equal to 60 nadika so it's a easy calculation it's also done in uh, uh, astrology astronomical calculation also involves this then you have uh, day 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 12 hours night 12 hours so again 12 hours meaning 12 into 2.5 uh, 30 30 nadikas so again 30 nadikas of night so uh, the day and night becomes one day become one day then one day becomes uh, what is called according to the paksha krishna paksha and uh, shukla paksha dark path night and bright path night <coughs> rather white path night is there so we have 15 days so 15 days becomes I mean two 15 days becomes one month so it's called a uh, uh, month actually masa in sanskrit also masa masa tamil la kuda masam so month and then you have uh, every two months uh, you have a uh, ritu uh, ritu ritu season so after that six months are called ayanam dakshinayanam uh, uttarayanam and then uh, the, the two ayanas become one year we have of course we have a calculation 365.25 days 1 by 4 days we have and of course uh, this is what we call the rotation of the earth around the sun and then so on we can connected with the uh, planets and then you have uh, after one year one year it becomes uh, thousand and lakhs and becomes yuga and you have uh, many 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 calculations many name many names of words you have you can do it in uh, bigger bigger number very bigger number. so you have you have a bigger number called arbudam arbudam 10 power 27 10 power 27 is called arbudam so we have so so much so this is uh, now now coming to the um, ritu season we understand in sanskrit there are three uh, ritus three seasons which are cold but we call them like this one is shishira ritu the other is hemanta ruto then third one is varsha ruto varsha ruto as soon as it rains we feel something cold some cold, cold climate of course it's not very heavy cold the shishira ruto and hemanta ruto whereas we have only one in english and two in tamil one in english will be winter season and uh, in tamil we have uh mare kalam as it as it is in varsha ruto varsha ruto varsha ruto is not varsha ruto because we want um, uh, heavy rain 
So Varsharup in plural. Varsharup is not Varsharup. And then we have uh, December, uh, January uh, months called Shishira and Heman. Actually, frosty season and snowy season. <coughs> it's a very, very, very not, not very clear line of demarcation. Frosty season and uh, uh, snowy season. So we have got uh, the Sanskrit uh, word. Uh, in Tamil also we have got uh, word uh, Kulur Kalam. Kulur Kalam. Parek Kalam Kulur Kalam. <coughs> in Sanskrit we have six uh, seasons. Grishma, Sammat, Vasanta, uh, winter, Vasanta is spring. And then uh, Hemant Rutu, uh, Shishira Rutu, and then Charad Rutu, autumn. Uh, autumn season. Yelayudir column, we say in Tamil, Yelayudir column, autumn, where the sky is clear without clouds and uh, the moon is very beautifully seen uh, during the uh, Sharad group. So we always say Sharad Kala Chandra. Sharad Kala, very, very beautiful. So without, uh, even, even if the moon is hidden by the cloud, we say it is very beautiful. Uh, and so in Alankara Shastra, we say it. So now we are talking about Sheeta Kala. Cool climate, uh, the sea, uh, cool season. So let us go to the next uh, page, thirty-two. Uh, so Ushna Kal. So we are uh, we are uh, actually at, uh, tossed between uh, Shita Kalam and Ushna Kal. We sometimes some of us feel very bad in cold season. Some of us feel very bad in the uh, summer season. And Hyderabad is one. Uh, Example of extreme climates. We won't call any other place. Hyderabad in Andhra Pradesh uh, contains both extremes the cold uh, season and the hot season. But here in Tamil Nadu, we say hot, hotter, hottest. That's all. No, no other season. No six season, but three seasons. So now this is a this is a concept. So let us understand the concept. Sita Kalam, Ushna Kalam, and the Just like it is only a comparison, it's only an analogy. Sattvika, Rajasa, Tamasadi, Kala Vibhagam, So Initially, it doesn't care about these three qualities the Kalam, the matter Kalam, the time. Whereas afterwards, it takes into account according to Sattvika Guna, according to Rajasa Guna, according to Tamasa Guna. The time is split up. Kala Vibhagam Undagam. Now I was telling you the uh, maximum number of years in the time. So we have Brahma Devasam. So one day for Lord Creator. One day for Lord Creator is 365 days is day, day time for uh, for Brahma, and again uh, another 365 days, it becomes the night. So that means two years is for two years or one day, two years are for one day for Brahma. Actually, it is here you given Brahma Devasam, of course, Brahma is to be understood because uh, Brahma, Brahma, that is Lord Shiva Narayana, has no time limit. So, Mudalaha. Manushya Devasa Pariyantamaha. So now we, under, we know very well our own time. Uh, Manushya Devasa. Human day. So Pariyanta up to. So up to the human day. Idu Kandukundu. Meaning the time differs every time. Every, every, for every human being it differs. Uh, and starting with the Lord Creator. Then... Suppose you take only one quality, namely the good quality, Buddha Sattvatil, Ipidipata Kala Vibhagam Indrike, in the case of Shuddha Sattva, when it is combined with the Rajas and tam Tamas, we have uh, uh, Kala Vibhaga is there, time split is there, time to tam. Whereas if it is completely pure Sattva, then you have Purva Aparadi Vibhaga Matrame Yirukum. So we are going to see in A uh, now and then after then we go to the next paragraph.
So A is moon pin middle A periwu matu. Very simple explanation. Purva and apara. Purva is earlier former F O R M E R and L A T T E R is apara. So that is for uh, caller time. The caller time will be without the division in sattva guna. It will be what we call the former part and the later part. Only two. Only two parts. So Kala will have only two parts. Now one, one example will be, uh, suppose you ask me, when did the uh, first incarnation uh, of Lord Shiman Narayana appear? So what, when did uh, the last, in, I mean, tenth incarnation, Kalki appear? And so on. Uh, each uh, Purana gives you a, a different list. Uh, sometimes we say Hayagriva is the first uh, uh, incarnation yeah, in uh, Vishnu Purana, and therefore now we go to the uh, now these are the these are the divisions under which we can split them and understand how we how we are uh, influenced by time. Uh, let me read the first word. Shuddha Sattva Mahavad. Okay, Rajas Tamasiti Chinnike. Go ahead. You can. Uh, நரகமாய் தோன்றும்படியான அனுகூல பிரகர்ஷத்தாலே பரமபத சப்த வாஷ்யமாய் இருக்கும் இப்படி Okay. So, Shuddha Sattvamavadu. So, what is a pure uh, quality matter? Shuddha Sattvamavadu. Shuddha, pure, Sattva, mm. good quality. Pure and good quality. So, now, this is the, remember, this is called Aprakritam, otherwise in Sankh. That is why we say, uh, Lord Shriman Narayana is made up of Shuddha Sattva quality plus the Vaikuntham, the original headquarters, living place of Lord Shiman Narayana, he made, he made up of Shuddha uh, Then, so, devoid of these other two, namely Rajas and Tamas. So, Prakrita Sattva Vilakshana Sattva Tukhi Ashrayamana Dravyam. In order that uh, our, our world, our world is Prakrita. And our good quality is called Prakrita Sattva. So there is a difference between Prakrita Sattva and Aprakrita Sattva. Now please uh, have this in mind because in my, now this must be remembered for the later Ragasyas also. So this is a very important point. The sattva has got two divisions. Sattva, Suddha Sattva has got two divisions. One is Prakrita Sattva and uh, Aprakrita Sattva. How do you distinguish by Aprakrita Sattva and uh, Prakrita Sattva is, or Prakrita Sattva is? <coughs> Aprakrita Sattva is better in quality. Therefore, we can say our quality is good, but Aprakrita Sattva is better. Or we can say Aprakrita Sattva is best and our quality is better. And among us, among the human beings, Suppose, suppose I call one, one a person a very good man and uh, I call somebody else better man. I come, I come, call somebody, still somebody else best man. I categorize people. How do I categorize people? Because of their good qualities. So some people have got, say for example, 10 good qualities. Some have 20 good qualities. Some have 30 good qualities. So it can happen in Prakrita. But whereas Aprakita is full of only good qualities, hundreds and thousands of unlimited number of auspicious qualities. But here, uh, unfortunately, it is combined with uh, both uh, Rajas and Tamas, and therefore we may not be able to good, I mean, judge properly any person whether he is good, better, or best. So, then Vilakshana Sattva. So Vilakshana means different. 
the satsat is again what are we are talking about the first word shuddha satsat sorry there was net problem okay no problem okay no problem you can join at, at any time the raghuram ji can join at any time so shuddha satsat is the vilakshana satsat vilakshana satsat the word vilakshana meaning different one meaning is literal meaning is different but it is better that means bet, better different but better that is what we call vilakshan the vilakshana satvatrike namely shuddha satvatrike that is pra, aprakrita shuddha satvatrike i qualify because it is very difficult to understand this concept uh, uh, now the our world for example our human life we has got prakrita satva and this prakrita satva we are all good people we are all fairly good people i say we are all fairly good people and because of the prakrita satva of the lord because lord has decreed shiman narayana has made us good but we are when we are bad let us not say he made us bad so we cannot say he made us bad because we know what good is and what bad is we know we have a discrimination mind that something is good and something is bad now that is why that is why we say uh, shuddha satvam is the substratum support for the mere existence of prakrita satvam in the world of creation so uh, again it can also i think uh, uh, be considered for insentient objects also uh, and i am i am of course i will confirm this point in the delay so when we deal with the insentient object that is a thoughtless object uh, jadam jadattam jadam jada vastu when we are talking about jada vastu we may sometimes have these divisions also for example a stone a stone is useful a stone is useless another stone is useless one stone is useful so in that way you can even categorize them as sattva or rajas or tamas then so how how um, blissful is our experience with the lord so he says sapari karanon shiyapati ki sapari kara sapari kara is always lord is associated with the creation is called saparikara also in association with the creation so if i am wrong footnote will correct me so shriyapati ki we are not talking of ramayana and narayana only please remember we are not talking of mahalakshmi only please uh, have a stress so we are all talking about a divine couple shriyapati now what happens to this uh, what you call prakrita satvam the prakrita satvam is being enjoyed by lord the divine cup bhogyam which we saw already bhogyam bhogyam is which is enjoyable enjoyable to the lord because again remember the lord only here though though we say we enjoy something in this world many enjoy many things in this world and that enjoyability is the property of the lord only because as the inner soul antaryami of our individual soul he has the uh, control over us and he has the benefit of enjoyability and bhogo uh, bhoga upakarana the instruments of enjoyment namely even our individual soul our body physical body and all other creations also become the instruments of enjoyment bhoga upakarana bhoga sthana roopam the form roopam the form he uh, has a place sthana the so bhoga sthanam is the roopam the form of the place the very place stay where we stay that that place is also uh, very important so because not only the individual soul but also his feelings his enjoyment 
but uh, added with uh, the place where you are one example will be suppose i perform sandhya vandanam at home uh, it is good it is uh, not bad but it is, when it is done in the temple we have what we call pancharatra or vaikhanasa established uh, with what we call divinity then it, it gives us more benefit of course there is no there is no advantage of performing sandhya vandanam because if we don't do it we incur sin if we do it we don't earn any merit that is the that is the beauty here but how come it will be more beneficial if it is done in a uh, temple especially on the bank of a tank within the temple on the bank of a river there are so many places where it can be done because there are all holy places the holy places uh, enhance the value of any ritual either fire or japa meditation or uh, tapas penance srirangam the whole island was uh, occupied by many sages in those days ancient time they were meditating and they were meditating the elephants came and uh, they they searched for water and they found plenty of found plenty of water in the kaveri and the, the padathiru kaveri tributary so they came and when they came they they disturbed the meditation of the tapas and japam of the sages and therefore they have to be driven off and uh, lord appeared as narasimha murti so uh, that is rather actually lion the lion form and uh, he has a temple what we call kartari singer in the borders of tiran so why is it uh, this is what we call bogasthana rupa i want i want to stress on bogasthana rupa the the, the not only the individual or objects of creation are important but also equally important where the objects of creation are enjoyed the bogasthana rupa uh, one one example you go to upliyappan uh, kovil near uh, kumbakonam you you worship the lord sinwasa not sinwasa he is supposed to be the elder brother of uh, lord sinwasa of tirupati suppose if someone uh, is not able to go to tirupati for some reason he, uh, the the prayer that he did for uh, the uh, what you call vapanam of the head that is the removal of the hair uh, he say uh, mudi mudi kudukkaradhu endra nalle so when they uh, there is a tonsuring eh tonsuring tonsuring yes tonsuring 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 very good so when we pray for a tonsure we can offer it in uplepan ko so that that will be that is one so here there so what happens is um, when you get the prasadam from the madapalli the kitchen of the temple they have saltless everything saltless any any salt uh, snack will be without salt normally salty snacks will be without salt but as you uh, take it as you um, follow it it will be very tasty of it will be it will be a good taste whereas you do it at your home of course after to play pavan at home also uh sometimes because of old age we also reduce the salt in everything uh, in every food item we reduce the salt today and then uh, for the sake of uh, keeping the blood pressure uh, in normal uh, so uh, that is not so much uh, uh, delectable as it is in the temple bogasthana roopam that is bogasthana So let us uh, and now understand. Lord Sri Manarayana uh, considers the prakrta sattvam of the creation as bhogya enjoyable, bhogya pakarana instrument of enjoyment, and bhogasthana. So this is 
this is where we get a surprise ananta ashtarya every time we are perplexed to know that it is a pleasant surprise it is uh, amazing it is awesome endless awesomeness uh, no end to the uh, amazing quality so where so now we go to the, the next one uh, after g kiranya garbhadi sthanangal ellam narakamai thotrumbadiyana anukulya prakrshathale parama pada shabda vachyamai now what happens is according to the enjoyment of the lord there is no difference of aprakrta sattvam and prakrta sattvam in his uh, um, in his side why because he he doesn't uh, differentiate between prakrta sattvam and aprakrta no what is he doing uh, by panchikaranam we saw in the last page the combination of combination and permutations of uh, all the 24 principles uh, you have kiranya garbha production kiranya is you know as you know very easily it is gold garbha is womb w o m b kiranya garbha is what we call cosmic egg there is the egg with uh, out of which the creation develops so hiranya garbha adi sthanangal ellam uh, we say hiranya garbha garbhastham vibhavaso uh, the, it is actually from the fire agne rapah adhyap prithivi prithivya oshadaya oshadhi jo annam annad vai purusha so in that way creation happens so hiranya garbha is uh, the uh, inner shell of the creation and it becomes what we call golden egg it is not mere egg it is golden egg even the earth you know it is in the elliptical shape we can say it in the egg shape the elliptical it is not uh, circular i mean or spherical as we uh, as ancient scientists saying that earth is spherical only uh, india gave the knowledge that it is elliptical and therefore uh, hiranyagar badi sthanangal ella so what happens to this narakamai thotrumudya so as we enter into this uh, life now as human being in this birth as human being so all these uh, places created created places become hell for us how because the vaikuntham the other world is uh, better in all respects sir. and therefore we feel this is hell we must feel this is hell uh, because there is a special quality called anukulya prakarsham anukulya meaning favorable congenial so when we whatever we feel congenial it is available in vaikuntham uh, therefore prakarshatale because of the highest <coughs> quantitative and qualitative uh, uh, suitability is available in vaikuntham therefore uh, the vaikuntham should be called parama pada shabda vach it should be termed as vacham vacham is we said as parama pada shabda parama pada shabda uh, that that constitute parama padam constitute Shuddha Sattvam is called Aprak. You must use the word Aprakrita again and again. Because it is supernatural. Prakrita is natural. That, is, that belongs to the creation. That is supernatural is, which is beyond our imagination. Everything is good there. Everything is favorable there. Everything is convenient. And that will be so Shuddha Sattvam will be called parama pada they are become they become synonyms perhaps a synonym so shuddha sattvam will become what we call will be called as parama pada that means there is no iota there is no iota of rajas and tamas in the vaikuntham and therefore 
So it is completely 100% pure sattva quality. There were, uh, suppose we experience it, then we can, we can, name, uh, we can ourselves call this as Paramatma. Now, one I mean, small experience that you know that we, that we experience here is as uh, Paramanandam. Uh, Ranga Prasad has, Swami has felt it uh, really by going through the Krishna Leela Tarangini uh, songs with the Bhakti by Narayana Tirtha. And he must, he cannot tell us, but he, has, he, he experienced as per the tradition of his father, the Paramanandam by hearing the song, by reading the song, by understanding the song, and so on, uh, about the Lord. And therefore, about Lord Krishna especially. And this is what we... And so here, any any questions can be asked, any, any clarification. Then if you, if you show me the page, uh, full page, Yippadi Moondru Vahayana Chetana Chetana Gloria. If time permits, uh, that's what we say, time permits. Everything depends on time, so we can go through this paragraph also. Before that, I can have we can have a discussion. Uh, of course, the, the, there are two points. One is when we when we understand understand it wrongly, we will question, uh, or we want to have extra points that we want to supply that is supplement. This this, uh, uh, com this commentary, then you are welcome. I think there is nothing to as a doubt. There is nothing as a doubt. These are all what we call injunctions, like scriptures, and uh, we we have to understand them as they are. That's all. Again, for Sunday, both young. Bogyas, Bogyo Pakarana, Bogyas Tana Rupa Bingarla, Bogyam Gardu, Bingasana, that is enjoyment. Yeah. No, no, wait, 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 let us see the footnote. Yeshoda uh, Swami will see this. And Apadam, you know, and the Bogyam Gardu, and he discussed Panino. He discussed Bogyam. So look at the word E, look at the letter E, Anubavika Sadhanam. Sorry, D, D. Anubhavikya Padam Vastu Bhogyam. Anubhavikya Padam Vastu Bhogyam. When we say Anubhavikya Padam, it means good experience, happy experience. It is not, it is not at all bad experience. You know, suppose your uh, children do not like uh, uh, while eating food. They do not like uh, bit, bitter God. Pahaka Sarvatika Pritika Dikvandaila Adana. So, when we become old, we enjoy the eating, um, maybe because of uh, our, uh, our body uh, condition. So, we need to have a bitter God. Pahaka. Uh, so, Pahaka, the, way, the same vegetable becomes good for old people and bad for young children. I mean, they, they don't like it. Uh, kashap, because it is bitter, we, they don't want to take it. So, D, Anubhavikya Padam Vastu. This is Bhogyam. Uh, e, that, what is Bhogyam here? All the creations, including the individual soul, including we, including us, the individual. Then, C, E, Anubhavikya Sadhanam, Bhogopa Karanam, Bhoga Upakaranam. Then, yes, Anubhavika Pangana Eda. Where do we enjoy? That's all important. Bhogasthana Rupa. Bhogasthana Rupa. Anubhavika Pangana Eda. Now, you please tell me um, <coughs> your question. Yeah, Adhyan, Baki Rendu and the Paka Kudya was too. Anna Bogyam Gurde, Bogya was to other on the Paka Mudia, the Stanamo in the Stana to a instrument to Buddha, Kanukateri was through. Anna and the Bogya was tungurde, Kanukateria was to the other. 
वस्तु भोग्य वस्तु टाइमजेबल ऑब्जेक्ट दैट यू कैन टच इट यू कैन कैन बी अच्छा हम कैन बी सीन कैन बी फेल्ट बाय ऑल द पंच कर्म ज्ञान इंद्रियस एंड आल्सो इन कर्म इंद्रियस यू कैन यूज यू कैन यूज द सेंस ऑर्गन एज वेल एज मोटर ऑर्गन टू हैव डायरेक्ट कांटेक्ट विद द भोग्य वस्तु वेयर एज द द एक्सपीरियंस The, the happy the happiness that you get out of uh, experience cannot be explained by words yato vato nivartante apratya manasasa is the saitya upanishad part neither you can imagine nor your mind is capable of telling us that anubhavika sadhanam anubhavika sadhanam i i give you the same example uh, i'll just uh, listen to you. जैगरीके salt and uh, sugar combined in a biscuit jack crack jack katta meeta ama katta meeta katta meeta katta meeta again again anubhavika pangana idam uh i must tell you the example so that uh, uh some rituals in temple Are uh, exclusively meant only in the temple. They cannot be practiced at home. That is, a, for example, I will tell you one interesting thing. Uh, Keshavdas Swami knows the family. Uh, Nanda Kumar and his wife Prema. Prema Nanda Kumar is a very great uh, journalist and uh, a frequent uh, article writer in Hindu and other newspapers. And uh, she is a professor of uh, Uh, visiting professor of Mahatma Gandhi University, Kerala, and she is a illustrious daughter of a, a great scholar in English, Indian English, A. R. Sinwasa Inga. Uh, A. R. Sinwasa Inga was the uh, vice chancellor of Andhra University, Walter, Vishakh, uh, called Walter. He is just some other name now. Uh, that lady's house. Uh, we have seen the vigraha idol of lord shriman narayan okay then done no problem but uh, she cannot uh, have the festival that we have in for uh, sri ranganatha the car festival the hanuman uh, carrier vahanam the elephant vahanam uh, kudrai horse vahanam all these are all and she used to uh, have within the hall of our brother uh, good house and she used to have some worship like then it is not possible uh, bangana you know the fittest uh, place for enjoying the lord is only temple with regard to the carriers bahana vehicles and that is I can have, of course, better examples are there. Uh, even the members of the uh, uh, August audience can say some better examples. There are some fit- fitting places. You cannot have uh, better experience in other places. Only in such a place, particular. This Parama Padam Kardanala. Are they? அதாவது கண்ணு போக்கிய வஸ்து இங்க வந்து அந்தரியாமியா சொல்றதா பரமபதநாதன் சொல்றதா இல்ல இது வந்து இங்க இருக்கிற அச்சாமுகிரத்தை சொல்றதா இல்ல அந்த வச்சு அர்த்தமா இருக்கு so uh, there is no doubt that these five forms also enjoy but we are not talking about bhokta who is the enjoy enjoy is only one shiman shiman narayana now is bhokya vastu are different 
Bhogya Vastus are different, namely all the creations including your individual soul. Bhogya Vastus is your Atma, Jeevatma. Your Atma, my Atma, my Jeevatma is part. Of course, it is not your and my, yours and mine. It is also different. Uh, it is, uh, they are also his soul. But uh, being an Antaryami in every creation, he is able to enjoy as a couple, as a couple. As a couple, they are able to enjoy entire creation. Whether it is uh, thinking capacitated as objects or thoughtless objects like what does uh, still of. <coughs> so he gets the pleasure out of enjoying the tree. That is why he creates. Otherwise he, he can remain idle. He never, he can, he never is idle. And uh, only one Bhokta. And Bhokta, as you said, uh, he can, he can uh, uh, it has a span over Bara Rupam in Vaikuntam, Vyuha Rupam in uh, Milky Ocean, then Vibhava Rupam in all incarnations, and then uh, uh, Antaryami in your mind, ha, and Achal. There is no doubt about uh, the five forms of Lord Vishnu in different contexts enjoying, but he is the enjoyer. Whereas we are only instruments of Jiva in the hand of God. Boga Upakaranam is Jivatma and all other creation. Ille in the Ipinda scans all in the scans all on the solar the Baki Hiranyagar Bhadi Sanangalam. Naragama is Tundrum Badiana, Anupuria Prakashatale, Paramoga the Shapta Vacha Magrida, this should the Satwat the person of Sundra. Why did it is mentioned? Kirenegar Bastana, the Lane, Naragama is Tundrum Badinga, it is only for comparison. Only for comparison. So comparatively, the Vaikuntam is better than, that is, Shuddha Shattam is better than, or Paramapadam is better than, all other creations which uh, look like enjoyment but which are not, which are to be avoided like a okay. Naragamai Totum Adalde, Ningalde, and Nenadina, on the Athala Mysore Park Pandraka, Krishna Sweets Labai Mysore Park. Kaimathur is the headquarter and it supplies to all places. Other than the better quality than your preparation at home. Uh, now, the, the accused one, right? so we yeah, are not okay, sorry. I, I actually, I, yesterday I have not attended. That is what I have some. I don't okay. understand this thing. That right. is what I, I mean. I am still I am in confusion. The Bogya, Bogya, Stana, Bogya, uh, Stana Rupa, and the Vastu and the Indus, Bogo Pakarana, is the only Yark election of the Yarka Sodra, the Namaka Sodra, Jiva Atmaka, Paramatmaka, and their friend Kudila. Namaka, I thought the Paramatma Suruba to Kosari, the Hiranya Gurba, Stanagala, Narama, you're then the Hiranya Gurba is the cosmic egg of creation. Analogy, comparison. Comparatively, how do you see? How do you certify some object as the best of? How okay, do okay. you? Because Shuddha Sattva concept, we are not familiar with at all. Shuddha Sattva, na, enna na, you will not solve the problem. Not, not, we cannot. Not possible. You must, but you must establish it, that is the best. In, oh. order to, in order to establish that Shuddha Sattam, otherwise called synonymously with Vaikuntham and or Paramapadam, so we have to compare it with a lower quality object. The lower quality object is Rambakanya, strong as a little. Naragam is a strong as a little. You are Naragam, Maria. 
this is not uh, any shastra will say especially in sri vaishnava sampradaya uh, suppose i feel fish out of water in this life then that is tamil sanna mullu mele nikkira maari irukkanum indha nama life nam nam appo da nama moksham ke we will aspire for moksha only when we are standing on thorns see when we are do because we are in the bed of roses and we are not thinking of moksha so when we when we suffer more then we will have what we call uh, artha prapatti there is a surrender a special surrender for, for, for the suffering people then we want immediate moksha immediate moksha is uh, sought for by people who are suffering the most now comparatively what we do is i compare me with you and say you are in delhi you are in uh, uh, extreme climate i am safe in sri rangam so i am better i say so then i met I, i my opinion this is my opinion subject to correction so i say i am i have better life here because no extreme cold no extreme heat then i say oh uh, are you suffering in delhi if i ask you uh, sometimes one may say i am in a health by transfer somebody goes to a far off place remote place and feels the hell there then he says uh, uh, i have come to heaven from the hell so this is comparison is only for comparison but of course it is what we call very serious comparison say the whole created world is uh, maraka no it will not be so serious all. but uh, what to say and uh, you have we have not seen narakam also you have not seen narakam but we have we have been experiencing narakam then and there here in life definitely we are experiencing some difficulty somewhere every one of us therefore uh, we don't call it uh, so for example one uh, gets his limbs broken kai kal odanjirukunu vechukonga do you know how much pain will one get i don't know i don't know his suffering but uh, some people have told me it is better to die instead of uh, yeah, uh, suffering the pain of um, broken limb when the for example you go to chittur near tirupati and you have what you call maavu katte suppose uh, the one hand is broken uh, and uh, they tie it, uh, they tie the hand position in it correctly because your hand will the hand should not look later bent hand something abnormal therefore in order to become normal uh, hand normal shape of hand they yeah they they round by wind round the uh, hand where the um, fracture is there uh, and uh, that the excruciating pain is hell and they, one one of my friends said even my my enemy should not get even my enemy should not suffer that kind of thing so by the by that pain so the, even even today the labor pain take for example labor pain some uh, mothers feel very heavy pain some mothers just like, like uh, uh, delivering very easily but putur mau kat you have another center called a uh, dr arjun's hospital in poru uh, near koyam so he also does the same type of um, treatment but very heavy very heavy pain painful treatment and we have ortho doctors in tiruchirappalli we have maruti hospital in tiruchirappalli where ortho surgeons are there uh, but uh, there is a there will the pain go the pain will be there but fortunately you and i have not fallen so far therefore that must be that, that is the Um, uh, therefore that we doesn't, doesn't mean that we are enjoying heaven um, uh, but uh, we have seen people uh, suffering in hell here in this world 
uh, i would also tell you my uh, grandmother had a sister and she had a lot of abortion 10 to 15 abortion and sometimes children died immediately after birth the children died within the womb so there is a lot of problem and we can we cannot estimate the amount of suffering since we have not seen the suffering so at least uh, hell if you read bhagavata purana you will get a lot of details about naraka yatanas the suffering in hell for every sin particular sin they have got special cell <coughs> special cell of uh, ill cheat and uh, when we read that we won't commit again the same sin <coughs> had we committed remember uh, remember uh, a person um, um, immersed in immersed in hot oil and will he will be whipped out at the same time <laughs> that is one type of uh, healthy hottest oil 100% degree centigrade sometimes 200 so he will be dipped in the oil and there are people who whip him smash him but my short time tamil short time so you can not imagine so this is so the art this refers to artha prapatti where we must feel immediate necessity of getting into moksha thinking that this is hell alvar says uh, many alvar say uh, i must refer to divya prabandham and say and say the alvar say very very uh, very pertinent that we must think of moksha instead of suffering in hell for a long time रामानुजदया पात्र ज्ञान वैराग्य भूषण श्रीमद्वेकनाथार्य वंदे वेदात देशिक कविताकसिंहाय कल्याणगुणशालिने श्रीमते वेकटेशा वेदातगुरव नम ूपुलुंड़मुनुंतने अमयादो तारणियवाने वाव